you may have noticed them rolling down bike paths and boardwalks, but have you ever, ever tried riding a Segway? I have not, but in our weekend adventure, Louisa joined a Segway tour and experienced a ride along the coast. Zipping. Oh, all I see is everything zooming by me. Gliding. It definitely feels like you're flying. And coasting along the coast. A Segway tour lets you experience a whole new sensation, turning a few heads along the way. Little kids are yelling out like, oh, I want to do that. It's awesome. At Segway LA in Santa Monica, we started with a little lesson. The first thing I want to show you is that this guy, when it's in balance mode, it's always going to be moving forward. We all battled some uneasiness and nerves. You've got a whole new center of gravity, so you feel like you're going to fall in all four directions. Put your hands Ooh, at your side. Oh my gosh. But the learning curve was fast, and we were soon leaving the shop and hitting the pavement for our tour. The Segway LA tour we're doing today starts at the Santa Monica Pier, goes to the Venice Pier with a few fun stops along the way. Our official Segway tour guide, Seth Canterbury, took us down hills and along the beach path packed with people. And soon our nerves melted away and were replaced by a growing confidence on these new set of wheels. You kind of felt a freedom that you could just go kind of fast and kind of turn and go anywhere you wanted to go. It didn't take long for this group to start showing off new moves and even letting loose with no hands. All right, we'll try it one last time. Yeah. No. Try? Uh, great, that was great. That's about as far out as you I'm going to go. Sarah and Ben Clancy, who were celebrating their five-month anniversary, even took part in a little hand-holding. And you feel like, all right, I've got some control over this, but I also feel like it's a little bit risky. For more of a challenge, we took a winding path up a hill. And at first, I wasn't sure I was going to make it up the hill, um, but it's, it's kind of getting used to how your balance is on here. That balance was needed on the way down that hill. As we started mastering the Segway, we began to soak in the beachy views, experiencing the coast in a different way as we whizzed by on our Segways in the sun. Wow, that looks fun. And the Sarah in the green in the beginning, she was a little you know, wobbly yeah. there and then yeah, long, right away. You pick it up right hands. away. I mean, I, everyone's kind of unsure about it at first, but, you know, it just takes a few minutes, and then I think you kind of get a hold of it. But then there's still challenges along the way, too. Like, they take you up the hill, and mm -hmm. it looked pretty nerdy on that, <laughs> on that segue, didn't I? Does just it work your down. abs? What does it feel like? No, it definitely doesn't work your abs. No, <laughs> your abs, maybe? Um, um, actually, you know what? I felt it in my feet, because <gasps> you're kind of using your feet in a different way so you're sort of feeling it a little bit mm -hmm. in that sense but um actually the day that we went in santa monica it was particularly windy oh. um which actually kind of made it a little bit more fun you know because mm -hmm. it kind of moved around <laughs> a little bit but um i have to say about this because you know you see segwaying all the time mm -hmm. and you kind of think like oh what you know segway mm -hmm. it's so much more fun than it looks really so much more fun oh, yeah wow. it's a great day and um, that couple that you know you saw holding hands it was their anniversary and uh -huh. i just thought what a great way to yeah. spend your anniversary you know yeah. well unless they fell then they <laughs> might have broken fell. up <laughs> <laughs> luckily there was no disasters awesome. on the segue no, but that's great but let us know what your favorite weekend adventure is uh let us know what you think i should try out next i'm game for most things <laughs> email us at weekend mornings at cbs.com